Hey y'all, I feel like I've been doing a lot of that lately, just so I can feel like I'm okay and I'm still not okay. These past couple weeks, these past couple months really have been just too much, too damn much. Ugh. If you've been just as frustrated and hurt and mad and upset and outraged as I have been, and you've been wondering, what can I do to make this better for our people? Stay tuned to this video. Our time is now. Our time is now for us to start literally putting our money where our mouth is. We need to start being conscious and smart about where and how we're allocating our black dollars. We need to start going out of our way to start supporting our local black businesses as well as online black businesses. And it may not be always the convenient choice. You might have to wait a little bit longer for that package to get to your doorstep. You might have to drive a little bit further and maybe to a place that you may not normally go to get the things that you need in order to support a black owned business. It is essential and crucial to the development and survival of our communities. It's time to start educating ourselves on being financially savvy and making better money decisions. Because let's be honest, y'all, we haven't always been known for making the smartest decisions with our money and where it goes. I mean, numbers don't lie. Don't shoot the messenger. It's time for us to stop living beyond our means. And chasing the flashy things for immediate gratification. We need to start strategizing and thinking long term about our futures and the future of our people. And when we can't support Black businesses, when the thing that we need, need, keyword need, because we buy a lot of stuff that we don't need, y'all, from these businesses that are not Black owned businesses, and it's not doing anything to recycle the dollar within our community. If it's something that you really need, then you can go and you can support other businesses. But if you do, please, please do your research. And do not support these businesses who don't support us. We need to stop supporting businesses that do not have our best interests in heart and that are not just as invested you know, as we are into the survival of our people. We need to start being smarter about where and how we are allocating our black dollars. I've started compiling a list of resources and websites for you to find local black businesses in your area. So you can go out and support those businesses and we can get that dollar to cycling much longer than six hours within our own communities. I'm gonna link those resources down below in the description bar. And as I get more resources, I'll make sure to keep this video updated with those resources. Um, maybe somewhere along the line, I'll put it on my Instagram or I don't know, I find some way to get this information out to y'all because this, this stuff is important. And so these are just some of the resources that I've found um, in my search for Black businesses in my area. Let's start reallocating that Black dollar, y'all. Let's start making a difference. This is, this is important. This is crucial. Protesting and riots, you know, those all have their, their place in the movement, but we also need to be strategic about how we are moving forward with uh, our commerce. Make sure you share those resources with all your friends and family, 
and make sure you hit the thumbs up button to this video as well as the subscribe and notification bell so you can be notified of all future conscious content. Y'all have a great day. Be safe, be smart, mind your energy, and most importantly, be yourself because nobody can do it quite like you can, boo.